Yo! This video is going to talk about diversity psychology and why Crazy Rich Asians is great for minorities using the story of Kimberly Yam. I have studied psychology for over a decade, minored in ethnic studies, and have seen my best friend psychologically damaged from the lack of diversity in the media. I will tell you why diversity psychology is so important for the human psyche and tell you the sad story of Kimberly Yam. This is a follow-up video on my Psychology of Haters video, click above to see. My name's Ryan Long, and this is the Unleashing Potential channel. Subscribe and hit that bell to not miss out on psychology videos to unleash your potential. Kimberly Yam is a 25-year-old Chinese-American who had tweeted many posts, some with over 383,000 likes, about her traumatic childhood experiences that made her not want to be Chinese during that time. On August 17th, 2018, she posted that when she was 8 years old, her class ordered Chinese food. She was excited to see her dad deliver the food since her father was her hero, but the other kids mimicked his accent and made fun of him. She didn't want to be Chinese anymore. Another tweet was when Kimberly Yam was 9 years old at ballet camp. A girl told her that another girl hated her because her eyes were ugly shaped. Kimberly didn't want to be Chinese anymore. Also, when Kimberly Yam was 16, she had classmates dress up for Halloween as Asian tourists who taped their eyes back. The thing that people don't realize is that the media is what dictates what the masses think is normal or not. If the media negatively stereotypes one group of people, then most people, particularly children, will be susceptible to believing those things as facts. One sad thing that the media has done for decades is depict certain groups of people negatively. In Asian American cases, depict them as Chinese restaurant owners who only speak in a thick accent and were all born in Asia. This is why one of the Hollywood producers wanted to replace the lead actress from Crazy Rich Asians with a Caucasian female due to thinking that would lead to better sales. This is also why Kimberly Yam's 8 year old classmates were laughing at her father and making fun of him since the media is biased towards showing certain groups of people in roles that are in weaker positions, it justifies in the children and many adult minds that it is okay to make fun of groups of people based on no facts but lies from the media. How would you feel if before you ever met someone for the first time, a stranger you never met told that person you were about to meet that you behaved in certain negative ways. You would probably be angry at that person. Well, this is what the media does. The media is that stranger. It tells every single person on this planet how certain groups of people will act and this causes people to have subconscious biases towards groups of people, often negative. What if someone thought just based on the darkness of your skin that you were more likely to be a criminal? Or thought from the shape of your eyes that you were not an interesting person? Or thought from the accent that you had that you shouldn't be living in the same country as other people? Well, every single minority person who lives in the United States has to deal with this every single day because the media is that stranger who tells the masses that people with certain physical traits and characteristics will behave in certain negative patterns. It is these negative experiences that psychologically harm people. Diversity in the media is key to breaking the psychological stereotyping that is so damaging to people, particularly to children. The sad thing is that experiences like Kimberly Yam are common. The director of Crazy Rich Asians, John M. Chu, had talked about his experiences in childhood that made him have negative feelings about being Asian for the majority of his childhood. Some people might be thinking, hey, get over it. These are just childhood experiences. Well, let's reframe it this way. Imagine a soldier just came home from war and has PTSD triggered by loud noises. Why don't you tell him to just get over it? Guess what? Childhood experiences can be just as traumatic as war experiences. The fact is, we need to stop children and adults from experiencing these negative, hurtful, traumatic experiences. Why should innocent people experience pain that is not their fault? Please speak up to help increase diversity in the media and support movies like Crazy Rich Asians and Black Panther to help show Hollywood that minority cast can bring in millions of dollars to the box office. If you learned something new from today's video, then make sure to subscribe to the Unleashing Potential channel right now. Just click on the subscribe button below this video. Now, I want to turn it over to you. Which new fact did you learn from today's video? Is it A, the media helps create negative stereotypes of people, or B, you need to watch Crazy Rich Asians ASAP? Let me know now by leaving a comment below. 
right now. Click above to watch the next important video. Stay tuned for more alpha male videos coming out soon.